massive hello everybody and welcome back to the channel i know it's been a while i know what you're gonna say where's your content lee where have you been but there is a good reason and we shall show you now take a look at this guys this is the new search and sonar boat as you can see we've got the sonar equipment here all mounted we've got the transducer all mounted on here we have got a johnson 9.9 .9 or 10 whichever you call it and we're going to go out and we're going to test it on the water today today is all about a bit of a trial see what it's like get used to it and uh, we're going to sort it all out and we'll come back to you in a minute so wish us luck guys we're just going to put it in the water here and we'll come back very shortly say hello everybody this is mark he's going to be with us you're going to see a lot of him on the videos now mark's going to be driving the boat while i'm sat at the front just there on my little pog with the sonar equipment but today is just about getting the boat in the water testing it and having a run through with the sonar equipment so we'll see you in a minute and we'll get out on the water we just got out of the boat there we're having a little break as you can see there's the setup we're really impressed with it it's got a nice little 9.9 .9 on it there's a transducer over there on the mount there's a sonar screen and mount we made the battery obviously we can move that under the bench and put a set of dive gear there what a lovely place we're actually here at tomb canal in northern ireland we've traveled from bally ronan it's quite chilly really cold at the minute I'm holding the camera and I feel my knuckles cold. But what we'll do is we'll jump in the boat, get it fired up again, and I'll show you the side scan sonar as we're going through this canal. We have dialed it in quite good so you can pick out branches, trees, anything. Uh, I've spent a bit of time fine tuning it downloaded all the updates for it so there we have it if you don't mind please hit that like share and subscribe that's really appreciated right i'm gonna jump in the boat uh, sit down get comfy fire the sonar up and then i'll show you some side scan and how we've got it dialed in sorry about the glare but this is a nice nice perfect speed 
if you can see here we're casting 30 feet over it's 30 feet to the bank look 30 feet feet to that side but look how good every picking up every little detail of the small rocks sorry about the light But yeah, we've got that dialed in nicely. I'll look at real vision. What this does, guys, this gives you an exact map out of the contours and what the bottom looks like. Anything that should be on shouldn't be on the bottom will come up red. So you'll see a red block. So for instance, if there's a car on the bottom that shouldn't be there, it will show you the red uh, block of the car. And we can zoom in. That's exactly what the bottom looks like. So it's nice and flat here, and then it goes down into like little divots here. So it's actually deeper along the edge than it is the middle. And you've got little holes here, look. So that's the 3D vision. And what you'd see is you'd see a square block. Yeah, if there was anything in there or a boat, you'd see it quite clear, it'd be blue. So let's go to down vision. That's the bottom look. Absolutely flat. There's nothing there at all. There's a nice bit of weed we've just gone over, look. Little pile of stones here. Mm. But from this gap here, the white line is the transducer. From the white line to the edge there, that's the depth. So from the transducer to the bottom is the black line there. And then anything from where the bottom is this side is the scan of the side out to this side and as you can see just here there's a, a log I think you might be getting a bit of glare, I am sorry. Right guys, there we have it. 
we've been out for a good while checked the boat out tested the sonar equipment as you can see everything is working spot on we've got the trailer there that we've spent a few days building it saves packing the boat does by the way it's got a nice aluminium hard floor it does actually all fold away and it does fit in the jeep but it is a nuisance and it's not an easy task but it can be done but we've chose to make a trailer and get the trailer going so that saves a lot of time but we've really enjoyed it the footage you are going to see i forgot to put the uh wireless mic on so there was no sound i did some great recording didn't get any sound whatsoever so you've probably been aware that it's just a bit of background music to what we was up to but i'll show you this boat look i'll turn the camera around there you go it's got the hard wheels on so you can just lift that and pull it out of the water on the ramp but what a job we're really impressed with it it's all good to go there's the trailer and the jeep over there look Yeah, but I hope you enjoyed this little episode. Like I say, it was just a tester. We wanted to get out there on the boat, test it all, make sure it all works fine. Uh, play about with the sonar equipment, tune it in, which we did. It was right over there by uh, Tomb Canal. But this is a nice little place called Bally Ronan Marina in Northern Ireland. This is Loch Ness, by the way, the big loch where we've been and all the way over that is actually Europe's largest body of fresh water Loch Ness right so there we have it if you don't mind please hit that like share and subscribe and we shall see you all very soon on the next one thank you and take care bye everyone